Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Anaya Sierra. And In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to achieve this look. I am not spending three million, okay, on lashes when you can literally just do it on your own. The process is so easy. It takes no time. Lashes last up to a week. These lashes, I think in my opinion, are the best alternative to getting your lashes done they look super cute everyone loves them and asks where i always get them done so yeah girl if you want to learn how to achieve this look please keep on watching okay so the first thing that we're going to be needing to apply our lashes are the lash clusters keep in mind that you guys can use whatever lash cluster that you get your hands on it doesn't matter where it's from i got mine from amazon personally um you can get yours at target or like walgreens whatever convenience store i guess but these are the lashes that I'm using today. These are the B and Q lash clusters and they range in size from eight to 16. I don't really like the whole spider look. So we weren't going for that. The next thing that I got, I did get these items in a set actually. I got it from Ulta. I think that you can purchase them on Amazon separately, but when I asked the lady like that worked at Ulta, she was like, no, you can't, but whatever. But I pretty, I'm pretty sure I saw it online. I think she just wanted me to buy the set. These are the tweezers that we are going to need. I just got them, like I said, from Kiss from Ulta. This is a really cute like tweezer. I love how it's blue and purple. I think that's super cute. Also too, we are going to need bond glue and then the seal that we need to use after we apply the lashes we need the makeup wipes just because as we're applying and using the glue sometimes things get a little bit sticky so makeup wipes definitely come in handy just to wipe everything off and make sure the entire process is clean and easy so let's hop right into this tutorial so i'm gonna be using my mirror so that i can see up close to my eye because i cannot see my eyelashes in this viewfinder but yeah so let's just get straight into it okay so now we're taking the bond glue out of that entire stick and we're going to be using that to go over our lashes that is the wand stick i love how the brush is like curved so it can go on our lashes easily so here you see i'm just applying it just like mascara that same bond glue that we used to put on our own lashes, we're going to put on the false lashes and make sure you're just applying a generous amount across the top so that it's able to stick to the lash because trust me, it won't if you don't apply enough. So as you can see, I'm just applying it straight across one individual lash as I go along. I'm trying like different angles so you guys see what's going on, but it's a lash. And these are the tweezers, so we're just gonna pick them up like that. And then I'm just gonna apply it right there, almost on my waterline, and then sticking it there. That's how it looks right now. Then I use the end of the tweezers to just squeeze the lash and my actual eyelashes together so that I know that it's staying in place. For the next lash that I'm gonna do, I'm actually gonna place another 16 on top of this one to make it more thick. So I'm applying it on top of this lash. Just like that. And it's supposed to look just like that. And then I'm gonna squeeze it together. Like that. And then the next thing we're gonna do is apply the 14. So as you guys can see, I am just brushing over my eyelashes again. These are like my natural. I would say that the eyelash extensions do a pretty good job of actually, I feel like, not breaking off your natural lashes. Maybe mine are just short, but yeah. So as you can see, I'm just applying it close to my waterline. This has not also never affected like my actual eye so i never had like a real allergic reaction because of it
Okay, so I finished my lashes. This is the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed that little voiceover. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna take that same stick and instead of using the bond, we're gonna use the seal. Just gonna brush our lashes just like if we were applying mascara. And you're just gonna like brush it on. It should get rid of like that sticky feeling that you feel if like you try to like blink too hard. That is the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed. This is a way cheaper alternative to actually going to get your lashes done because we're not spending three million every weekend. Um, you guys can check out these lashes in my Amazon storefront that's linked below. All you gotta do is just go to makeup or beauty, add the lashes to your cart, and you're good to go. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and follow me on all of my social medias and I'll see you next time.